Hey everyone, I'm Michael Short. Come on, let's go outdoors. You know, from the northwest, along the eastern slopes, all the way down to the farthest reaches of southern Alberta, perhaps no other provincial fish has been studied more intently than our provincial fish, the bull trout. There is a good reason for this kind of attention. Over the decades, the traditional range of this fish has continued to retreat. Spawning grounds and habitat have shrunk to the upper reaches of colder eastern slope waters. Given its reduced range and lower population numbers, bull trout now carry a threatened species rating. Establishing a baseline population estimate and a distribution range of where the bull trout travel and spawn was one of the first tasks by the ACA biologists. Numerous waterways have been visited to determine the presence of bull trout. Now this is accomplished in several ways from a simple hike through the water looking for spawning reds to electrofishing And in some cases, elaborate scanning stations were established, reading tagged fish to provide valuable information on their movements. And even underwater cameras have been installed to track fish movement. Assessing habitat conditions is another critical component of supporting and effecting change to protect bull trout. As this information is collected, it's then passed on to various industry and government partners to help better inform their land management plans. While the future of our provincial fish may seem a little uncertain, efforts to better understand its range, population numbers, spawning territory will continue thanks to the efforts of the Alberta Conservation Association and its many partners, thus ensuring that bull trout, our provincial fish, remains part of Alberta's freshwater resources. Till next time, I'm Michael Short. Come on, let's go outdoors.